Ladies and gentlemen, we are back once again. It is your two favorite podcasters. I'm Platini. And my name's Plaque. And we are two peas in a pod. Can you tell them what number episode this is? Numero tres. Tres. Yes. Twa, if you're Haitian. That's how you say in Creole. Before we start the song, protect your energy beanies. If you're looking for one. Yeah. I could probably middleman you. To my dog, Sammy. I'll see what I can do, you know? Shout out, Sizzle. Salute. Me and my boy, P. That's we me. Was, we was looking in the Disney Plus section, and we saw that, what? Guardians of the God. Not just Guardians of the Galaxy. It was a holiday special. <laughs> <laughs> Yo, it was actually really, really funny. Um... It's of a fun course. watch. It's, it's what, uh, what what the new kids are calling today. A fun watch. Like always, Guardians of the Galaxy always has that humor and brings us into the MCU. But they also have some good Easter eggs. Shout out to Kevin Bacon. Yeah, salute Kevin Bacon. <laughs> that was uh, a surprise. Wasn't expecting to see a Kevin Bacon in a Marvel movie. But hey, I'm sure the checks are fat, so... Come on in. Everybody's uh, hopping on that right? uh, One thing I did learn is do not leave Drax and Mantis alone anywhere. Yo, like, if you're familiar with them with the mo- in the movies, there's nothing new. They're probably even more stupider in this uh, um, holiday special. But, yeah, go ahead and check that out. Two coolest beings... With superpowers? Nah, not a good mix to be alone. <laughs> all you need to know is that they do mean well. They always do. Also, shout out to Nebula. Yo, salute to Nebula. When I can tell you why I was shouting out Nebula, no you'll, spoilers, see, no spoilers. you'll see why. You'll see why. You'll see why. You'll see why. Nebula. Ah, ah, do not forget a certain character. A dog. I'll just, I'll just give you a clue. Who am I talking about, sir? Cosmo. Yes. Tell me about Cosmos. So, for those of y'all who don't know who Cosmo is, he is a Soviet dog. An Earth being, Earthling dog. A legit dog. Literally a dog. A dog. Inside of a astronaut suit? Yeah, yeah an yeah. astronaut suit. Astronaut suit. Uh, this dog has specific powers, though. Besides it already having, you know, the dog powers as far as super scent, super hearing, my man's got telekinetic powers. Tele- telepath. He's a telepath. What? Telekinesis? What? Coming from Why? a dog that's just wild at the end of the day. And um, when they introduce you to Cosmos in the movie, he's already, you're already going to get an idea of what his powers are when you see what he's doing at the time. You'll get a glimpse. Mm-hmm, you mm-hmm. Don't, we don't want to spoil it for you, but you'll get, a, you'll get a glimpse of what he actually can do. From what it looks like, and I hope they're continuing with Cosmos, I guess... He's gonna be a new member, right? Like we're gonna see Cosmos in other Marvel. Yeah, he's part of the Nowhere Corps, which is where they are. Uh, that's where most of it is taking place in the mm-hmm. movie in Nowhere. Um, he's also a Guardian of the Galaxy. If y'all didn't know of that already, now you know. <clears throat> and uh, just a little backstory: my man has gone toe to toe with Adam Warlock. You heard it here first, ladies and gentlemen. If you didn't know, if you don't know, now you know. Cosmo. <laughs> <laughs> You're still <funny>. Cosmo. <laughs> Eagles, Eagles. All those wins come, but they wanna hate. All those wins come, but they wanna hate. E, Eagles, <laughs> Eagles, Eagles. When we fly, you know we fly high. Hey, when we, we fly, fly you know we fly, fly high. high. Hey, first team. To get to 10 wins in the 2022 season. 10 of them tanks. It's okay, man. One L. That's cold. I ain't even worried about that L. That's cold. We went one and one with that division rival. It hurts. How many name changes have they have in a two-year span? Ah, uh, we still Eagles. Fist forever. We flying high. Don't Yo, do that. Shout out to Jalen Hurts. Shout out to Jalen Hurts. Shout out to Watkins. Watkins with the back. Mm. Watkins. Shout out to Brown, even though I was mad at him in the beginning. He no. came back and made that. And, and was it, pardon if I pronounce your name wrong, but you were wilding out this game. I have to give you your props. Blankenship? Woo! Blankenship! First undrafted rookie. You ready for this? I'm ready. First undrafted rookie to intercept Aaron Rodgers. Well, what a stat, my boy. 
Hey. He intercepted old man Aaron Rodgers. Mr. Hiawaska himself. You know what I'm saying? Listen, man. Can y'all stop hating on Jalen? Uh, Even if you don't like the Eagles, you only have to res respect what the QB is doing. 300. Was 300 plus? 300 total yards, yes. 360 plus yards as a team rushing. Madness. Shout outs to Hertz, Miles, Gainwell, and Mr. Boston Scott himself. Thank you guys for doing your thing. But then, wait, we can't, we can't leave these boys out. The old line up front. If it wasn't for y'all, thank you. We wouldn't have these. Who is yards. they screaming for? Uh, one, 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 not, not this Kels. On, 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 on the D line, oh, whatever the D line play. Who am I screaming for? Fletch, Fletch dog. He showed Pressure. Up. He showed up. Come he showed on, up. man. D line showed, showed up. up. Everything was looking good. Even though the defense did give up some points, it's okay, <sighs> man. We cool. learned from these That's mistakes. Just... We've been having troubles with the rush defense. We got two D tackles, veterans in the game. But, you know, it's okay. We get Jordan Davis next week for the big, heavy body Titans. It's okay, man. Respect to Henry, but we got to shut y'all down at home. If you want to see what it looks like when Titans fall, tune in. Ooh. Don't do that. You know A.J. Brown's going to go in. <laughs> it's a revenge game. He was a Titan. Now they come into our house, and now you're going to show out. You have to show out. He's going to show out. I ain't worried about it. My man was sick all week, and he still... Played in the game. Yeah, he had, he had me sick. He had me all of sick. Us. All of uh, us. Dropped many op opportunities that would have put us up there. But because Jalen is such a leader, he gave him more opportunity, more chances to make that up. And he did just that. Scored that touchdown. Mm -hmm, little mm -hmm. toe, little. Mm -hmm. <laughs> slid, slid the toe on. That's the make. <laughs> Call it the forward moonwalk. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Hey, man. Jalen Hurts. Historical night. Historical night. 125 plus passing yards, 125 plus Crazy. rushing yards in a single half. Crazy. Broken record. 157 yards total rushing. Crazy. Broke a franchise record previously owned by the late great Michael Vick. Crazy. Come on, man. Y'all gotta stop hating. Stop for the real, hating, man. man. Shout out to the Eagles. No turnovers. Two touchdowns. Who's oh, yeah. doing it? No, oh. no, no. Hurts. Hurts. I was about to say, okay, okay, Hurts. okay. Just making sure. But I don't think we did. No, we didn't. But still, regardless, man, Hurts, man, y'all got to stop doing this, man. Talk, man. Oh, he's a running back. Even if I wasn't an Eagles fan, I was another fan, and I'm seeing what Hurts is doing as a QB for his team, golf claps. I got us a little. My man sets the temperature when he's in the room, bro. Mm -hmm. You see it. I showed you those pictures of him throwing, same face. Him running, same face. Composure. Him celebrating, same face. Mm -hmm. Stone Cold Steve Austin out here, Keep man. Keep control. I like we that. We out here, bro. 10-1 on the season. 33-40 to 40 win against the Packers. See y'all next week. Mr. Tennessee Titans at the Lincoln Financial Field. Fly, Eagles, fly, baby. That sounds like... You already know what time it is, y'all. Mm-hmm. Them, them wings look sexy. A little tasting. We're going to do a little tasting today. Now... Can you tell me why you've brought these wings out, my good sir? So, going back to episode one, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. we was watching the fights, correct? Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Specifically, the Dustin uh, Poirier and Michael Chandler fight. Facts. And it just so happened, during the fight, they were promoting uh, Mr. Poirier's hot sauce. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. You know me, being the chef, being a foodie, I said, hold up. Without him even knowing, I went straight to Amazon and I purchased Mr. Poirier's, Mr. Diamond, his Louisiana style hot sauce. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Showed them, showed them that. Boy, holla at us. What is this? The bottling's fire. I like how they got the diamond on there. Mm -hmm. Little cap clothes open. You don't got the crusty cap where you got it. You know what I'm saying? When you get the hot sauce with the crusty cap. <laughs> nah, man, this is fire. I like this, man. <laughs> Louisiana style hot sauce. Mm -hmm. So we're gonna go ahead and taste it out. Yes, we about to try this. I can't wait, actually. Let's see what happens. Here, let me go ahead. Let me go ahead, dab it up. Uh, 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 uh. There you go. Felt it. Hopefully, hopefully the camera sees this. Yeah. It, oh, okay. You gotta get the other side too. That's how you feel. So you can, so you can get all the flavors. Save oh. the flavors. Okay. Mm -hmm. Shout out to Dustin. I mean, I only put a little bit, but all right, let's see. Let's see where we're going. There you go. All right. Yo.
You know what's crazy? Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. It's hot sauce, right? Talk for me right now, because right now, I'm, I'm enjoying the flavor. Bro, I can see why you put so much on there. The flavor is something else. Like, yeah, the, the spice comes in afterwards, but as soon as you... Like, okay, the wing. It's a wing. It's a Publix wing. Shout out to Publix. But the taste that the, the, the hot sauce is giving me off rip... Yo. Just get the damn hot sauce. I can't... I'm not even gonna waste your time. Oh, how good it is. It's this is blah. Get the damn hot sauce. Doesn't he have levels? This is what... what um. That's the beginner. That's mm -hmm. the regular mom. Mm -hmm. It's still spicy. Don't get me wrong. Now, me being a Caribbean baby. Yo, it's shocking because this man does not like hot sauce like that. Mm -hmm. <laughs> like the flavor. That's what's throwing me off. The flavor of the hot sauce. Like, see? Now the hot sauce is starting to settle in. Now my tongue is getting... <laughs> but it's not kicking your ass. Mm -mm. She just our third episode. Episode three. Most importantly, cheers to y'all. Thank you. Yo. Hold on. While, I'm, while we're on the subject of MMA, I haven't had time to make my predictions or even look at the card this weekend. I do know Stephen Wonderboy Thompson mm. and Kevin Holland is fighting. Without me doing my due diligence and doing my homework, as I usually do, I'm going to go ahead and go with... Wonder Boy, for no specific reason, just because I like his style more. I like that karate point style he brings to MMA, that whole style, uh, sideways stance and all that, and how he uh, uses his kids, kicks to his advantage. And Kevin Hall is a good guy. He's on the come up. He, every fight, he gets better and better. So, like, even if Wonder Boy loses, I'll have no problem with Kevin uh, winning. But my pick, I'm going to go with Wonder Boy. I was going to say, he's going to put on a kicking clinic. Yeah, he's going to put on a kicking clinic, and I want to see... I don't know how Kevin will be able to take that because Kevin's not a wrestler That's, like that. I was going to say, he's not a, yeah, he's not a grappler. Mm -hmm. That's interesting. Word. Anyone, anything else you want to hit him with? That hot sauce is fire. <laughs> I'm sorry, I'm, lo I'm lost in the sauce, literally. Like, I'm literally... Lost like, in the sauce! You hear that, Dustin? You got my boy lost in the sauce! Oh, yeah, I appreciate you, man. Yo, that man's a, he's a, a treasure for real, for real, man. Mm -hmm. Giving out to charity. You got your own freaking Yo, hot sauce. He brand. really is the man. He got his own hats. He got his own shirts. And he's a hell of a fighter. Oh, yeah, yeah. He got him. diamond hands, bro. Mm -hmm. Every time he hits, they get rougher and rougher. It's nasty. Nasty work. Just a quick reminder if you forgot. My name's P. My name's Plague. And this was another episode of Two Peas in a Pod, baby. Thank you for joining us. And we will look forward to seeing you again. Next week, Wednesday. Holla at us.